Hello, Ate. Hi, good afternoon, everyone. It's nice to be with us together through the leadership of our uh, director, Rita Olaita, as our caregiver uh, uh, president. And besides that, we have to celebrate the uh, outgoing of our uh, president, Rodrigo Rua Duterte, Mabuhay na President. And well done for the uh, nations of Philippines. And keep up for your uh, strong determination of restoring our beloved Philippines. Uh, and uh, thank you for the incoming elect President Marcos Jr. that your promises will be granted to more restoration of our country Philippines to have a peaceful living one day we are all coming home back those who are living in Canada everywhere of the nations we will come to enjoy our nations which is Philippines thank you hello my name is Virginia Aduka a resident of Canada but Our former president, outgoing president Rodrigo Duterte, and he's the amazing president that have uh, happened to Philippines. And thank you so much for all the job you've done, Mr. President. And thank you for the thank you and congratulations for the incoming president BBM Marcos. Love and support to all Filipinos, not, not only the, the other side, but everybody. We will hope for the new progress of the Philippines. Thank you. Hi, my name is Vivian Smith, and I'm friends of all, most, the yes, majority sir. of Filipinos friends. in Canada. Although I didn't know the PRRD president, but I say goodbye to him with all his followers and I hope the new one will do things good for the people of Philippines and I hope to be in the Philippines someday to meet him. Thank you. So for Marcus, I didn't know him either. I just heard good news of good things about him and I hope he'll do good for the people of the Philippines. And I, one thing I ask of him for more immigrants and caregivers to come to Canada to pursue their dreams. So, thank you. I'm Emma Rios from Toronto. I really, really love you both, Mr. Bongo Marcus. And I am so happy and I um, that you are our president. And we hope um, for many, many more years of success and good health. And I hope to be home soon. Thank you. Good afternoon, everyone. Good morning, Ita Philippines. Magandang araw, magandang gabi. Kung saan man sa lahat ng mga Pilipino. So, nagpasalamat ako. Ang pangalan ko si Eva Teria Bonilla. Uh, thank you, PRRD. Salamat sa uh, kabutihan mo sa pag-discipline, uh, sa paggawa ng mga dapat na gagawin na hindi nagawa sa ibang mga presidente. Ikaw lang ang nakagawa. So, salamat, salamat sa iyong effort na ginawa mo ang lahat ng makakaya. Salamat po, salamat po, Mr. PRRD. For Bongbong Marcos, thank you. You are our next president. You are already a president in our heart. So, salamat and thank you for stepping your steps to be a, a secretary of the agriculture. Because I am a farmer, I have developing also in the Philippines. Thank you. I'm... Magandang umaga sa inyong lahat. Ako po si Lydia Soliver na nagpapasalamat sa ating mahal na Pangulo Rodrigo Roa Duterte sa kanyang pagmamahal sa lahat 
na mga Pilipino sa loob at labas ng ating bansa. Maraming salamat po. God bless you. Mabuhay. Huh? Hi, good afternoon. My name is Joe Boras from Toronto, Canada. Pinay na Pinay. Thank you so much for your service, uh, President Rodrigo Duterte. Um, uh, isa po ako, caregiver na dumating dito and I tried my best to um, to, uh, to serve our community also na I'm a business owner and I'm proud. And yung nanay ko din po is from Hong Kong and now she was so proud of me and all the whole family and all Filipino I think um, you give your full service and your dedication for peace and um, unity and naging maganda ang ekonomiya ng Pilipinas so we're very happy for your term and it's sad to say that you're going but God bless you and your family and for the incoming president um, President Marcos welcome and we will be praying for your success in your term thank you and God bless Hello and welcome. Just want to thank out Phil Can Family Win for inviting me to this special occasion to honor the outgoing president and also celebrating the new President Marcos in his new term for the President of the Philippines. I wish the Philippines much success. Uh, there's a large Philippine community in Canada who represents a beautiful population here. And I wish all the Filipino people all around the world and much success in the future. God bless. Bye. Ayan, itong araw po na ito ay talagang aming wait, wait, wait. ipinagdasal upang maipatid namin ang mainit na pasasalamat sa loob ng anim na taon na panunungkulan ng ating Pangulong Rodrigo Roa Duterte. So in the next day, 24 hours or so, he will be saying goodbye and leaving the Malacanang Palace and we will be welcoming our new administration through the leadership of the young Ferdinand, Ferdinand Rom, uh, Arad Romualdez Marcos Jr. So, and the Vice President, uh, young Inday Sara Duterte the daughter of, of our President Rodrigo Roa Duterte. Oh, why are we very thankful? Majority of the Filipinos are very thankful um, in the leadership of Ro Ro President Rodrigo Roa Duterte. His campaign for the war on drugs, many parents have been very thankful because they find peace while they are overseas because their children has been drawn with drugs issues. And that is a very big problem. In the peace and order where there is also insurgency. So Mr. Duterte is trying to, uh, had really done his best to invite those who are not satisfied or who are against the government to come and join the government and help address the issues causing the insurgency or the unrest. Um, there is also the education, which is the universal education now, that all the children from elementary all the way to college and universities is free education. And that has been attained at the leadership of Mr. Duterte. So uh, uh, we are very mindful how this education is going to be uh, very helpful for all the citizens, for all the youth and the young ones. They just have to really uh, do their best to become the best graduates and become competitive across the globe. Um, the other very good uh, achievement, a legacy of Mr. Duterte is his bill, bill, bill. And my brother or friend here who had said something 
Um, I really appreciate him speaking out what he thinks, what he believes. But we are very thankful because of the build, 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 and um, every corner of Philippines, north, south, east, west, all the values of the properties went up uh, because of the build, build, build. Uh, the bridges and the roads and uh, um, um, the, from market to, uh, from farm to market projects, helping all this agriculture to bring their products to the market. And every government, uh, governors, every Congress, uh, senators are all working together to elevate the economic life of every single Filipinos. And there is also the program for the Overseas Filipino Program. And um, Mr. Duterte is the only president who stepped up and went to Middle East and really negotiated with the government and with the employers to stop the abuse and the exploitation. I, 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 can, I cannot enumerate all the good things PRRD has done to Philippines. But we here, the OGs they go, I learned yeah, that OGs. Uh, uh, OGs, what is OGs? Well, they say, oh, the old gangs. <laughs> or the old groups, or... Old school. Uh, uh, old schools, yes. And um, we, we here who came and celebrate this special day are the um, grassroots of the 1980s. And we have seen how Philippines has really grown up. And we are now more than 30 some years here in Canada. And I'd like to congratulate each and every one of us here because all of us can say a success stories like being she brought her family she was reunited uh, a daughter and a son and they were only nine ten year old now her her son Julius let's give her a big big hands because uh, now he is a Toronto police Julius Agamata and uh, we have here Virgie and uh, Virgie also is um, a caregiver who brought her family in here and all her children are in good hands and they are very productive and and her members of family are are, are, are growing in numbers and they're in college and everything and all their dreams to have their own home, house and lot, the cars, their business, whatever they want to do, they were able to achieve in a period of 30 years. So we also have a friend, Vivian, here, who keep us going and uh, thank you because she adopted us her, as her sister and uh, likewise, we adopted her also. Uh, and. Um, she herself is, um, she came here through work permit and now she has a granddaughter who is a doctor. So let's give her a big, big, big hand. Uh, we have Eva. Eva. Eva has two children and a very good husband and also su successful. Her, her daughter is a banker and uh, the, 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 um, the son is a businessman. And both of them, she and, and, and Glenn, are very good leader in our community. They are the mobilizers for the parents, the youth, families, and friends in action. So we have Lydia. Uh, why I'm introducing them? Because they are my young, old groups. We were here in the 90s, and here we are celebrating and appreciating life. So we continue to work with the government, uh, both here in Canada and in the Philippines, because that is our component. We believe in what we can contribute, not just a receiver, not just to hand pan, but we contribute to Canadian society. And let's give a big hand to Ellie. Ellie is a very successful businesswoman and uh, she is in the financial and investment services and you can go and talk to her uh, and
success serving mainly to our community because we are the grassroots and we work so hard for our money and she is there to educate and inform us and connect us with different agencies so we could continue to fulfill the dreams that we've been dreaming for. So to our president, Rod Rodrigo Roa Duterte, we love you so much. Thank you very much for all your excuses about the water, about the electricity, about the root causes of poverty, the impact of the corruption and the uh, war on drugs, we and, and the distribution, equal distribution of wealth. We continue to pray that our incoming administration, the young Marcos and the young Duterte, will continue to pick up those strong agendas so that we can all continue to move forward. So we sincerely thank Eric and Chris, the owner of Republica, because for them to allow us to gather together here to celebrate our thanks and our goodbye to PRT and hello to uh, Ferdinand Marcos Jr. and to Vice President Indai Sara. God bless us all. Mabuhay. Okay,